I'm going to be doing some chores and somewhat decorating the barn for Christmas. Okay, right, first I need to clean up all these troughs. As you can see, they are completely filthy and have algae and hay and whatever else is in them. So first I got to dump them. I need some help. So we're gonna have to kind of turn it. You need to move that bottom cord, the yellow one. We have officially flooded the yard. Okay, now that I got them all dumped with a little bit of help, I'm going to use a little bit of bleach to clean them out. Um, I know a lot of people don't know, but bleach is safe to use for cleaning out your troughs and it actually has a little bit of salt in it, so it actually encourages your horses to drink uh, more during the summertime. We don't leave a bunch in there, but if we don't get it all rinsed out, it's perfectly fine. So I'm just going to pour a little bit. No, Molly. Well, get back. Now I'm just going to use an old body brush to scrub these out.
so while the troughs are refilling, I gotta clean up this mess in here. Uh, it's not as bad as what I thought it was gonna be for having six horses, but let's get cleaning. cleaned up. It's not perfect. It needs power washed. But we're all done. Okay, so now I'm going to hang up the horse's stockings. Um, I'm going to hang them on the ladder because 
if I hang them here or up there like I wanted to, Molly will eat them. I'm hoping she doesn't eat them as I hang them on the ladder. But just to make sure, we're gonna put Molly's on top because if anything, she'll eat her own then. Now let's I'm hoping there's enough staples in here. That'll work. my whole saddle. I need to sew ginger stocking slightly. Oh well. If we get any horses, I don't, any more horses, I don't think we're gonna have enough room. Okay, they're all hung up. Okay, we kind of got interrupted because my dad walked in. But all the stockings are done. They look decent. I have a feeling Molly's definitely gonna eat hers and Rose's. We'll have to see. But I hope you enjoyed the video. And see you next time on Equine Passion.